my sweets welcome back to the channel today i want to take you guys on a vacation in my hood honey yes show you some sexy places you're gonna help with us and go with us on our anniversary if you're new here go ahead subscribe hit that notification bell so you know when i upload a new video yes yeah, gonna show you some places around so this is day one i had just got off from work was excited thank god it's time to start my vacation Woo -woo. I was ready to go get something to eat, get something to drink, and not be worried about damn work, okay? We hit up the Red Robin. Yes, summer vibes. Yes, first vacation day, and I am cute as fuck. What? Yes, honey. Shirt from Rainbow. Pants from the Nova. Shoes from Rainbow. And and this cutie booty piece that's on my head i guess you better check down and go see what unit this is what period pool mm -mm -mm. yes honey ass out all the way up to the side yes period Ew. after that we are off for our drive road trip we was headed off for breakfast that morning yes out in the rona wanted to see how it was so we just hit up ihop that was a picture of us in the booth the food was pretty good you can't get shit from the car motherfucker because my motherfucking car clean hey y'all hey, 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 hey. now we finna like? travel out to the mall we finna get some, we shit. Get some shoes yeah some some shit get some shoes to my toes uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you laughing. Okay, all right, whatever. Yeah, whatever I, don't, I don't know about all that, but all right, I'm about to put we these about to feet, be here. I'm about to put these feet in some nice upcoming Jordans. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know about all that. Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> So after that, y'all, he's so damn crazy. We headed out to the shops at the Braven. This is the bougie part of Washington. This is Bellevue, Washington. Talking about So pretty. A beautiful backdrop. Beautiful. The Gucci. The Gucci, Gucci. Yeah. Gucci, Gucci. I don't know about no Gucci Gucci. <laughs> so this is the beautiful waterfall that is in the cul-de-sac of the shops at the Braven. Downstairs from the sugar factory. It's so beautiful, y'all. I love it. Isn't that beautiful? So we're just walking up. We're passing the Gucci store. Yes, the bougie bougie. Mm-hmm. They, they had the red, the red line. little <laughs> line and laid out. Okay, as you go in the a store. Bitch. Well, yeah. I am a bougie bitch, but it's very I bougie. bougie. Mm -mm, not to be giving my money to some damn Gucci Gucci. Like Wanna be talking shit? Yeah. Let me talking shit. I learned it from you. So this is the view from upstairs when we walked upstairs where the sugar factory is located. This is a picture of our food. I got the wings. He got the chicken strips. Okay, dry ice. Yes. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. That's still bubbling. Look at the water <laughs> mm. Now we are headed to Bellevue Square. Had to take a quick pic for our left. We are at the Hyatt, checking into the hotel. 
Look how gorgeous no, this is, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> at the hotel down here is always a refrigerator big refrigerator which I'm about to wipe everything down then you have like a table mirror and this is like the living room. Yes, look at that. Welcome, Mrs. Allen. Mm. Mirror. Bathroom. I'm about to clean all of this. This is already touching stuff you ain't even let me sanitize shit yet oh, you're sanitized, but... yes yeah, so i gotta get the sanitizer wipe all of this down here's our view from the room that goes straight to the back to the parking garage about to clean up first thing i'm doing is turning this ac on turn this fan on next i'm gonna spray my room with disinfectant i'm gonna spray these pillows because we will sit in here. Say that I'm extra, I don't give a damn. I'm gonna spray this shit. I'm gonna have to check these sheets and I bring us travel sheets. Our travel sheets on here. And you guys can get these from uh, Amazon. I bought these from Amazon, so I'm going to put our travel sheets on here now. So here are some travel sheets that I bought because sometimes sheets be nasty and they don't be cleaning the sheets. I did check the sheets and they were not too bad. There was one stain, but I bought these specifically just to stay, stay, to stay safe and kind of wanted to try them out as well. Got both of these so off of Amazon. This is what travel sheets look like. So this is the travel pillow. Once you undo it, it becomes a blanket. And then this is the travel sheet. So we have the pillows up under here. And then this, you lay up under this and it snaps. So it'll snap you in. So your feet and everything is up under this travel thing instead of, see at the bottom, it's all up under here instead of being up under nasty ass sheets. So I thought it was good. I'm going to try it out, see how we like it. You got to be like the person you with because you're going to be like extra close. But we're going to see how it works out. The thing I invested in is my own ice bucket. Because motherfuckers be nasty. They don't be cleaning out these ice buckets. I bought this for, what, $20 off of Amazon. Comes with its own little thing inside and I know it's just my hands that's been on it. Husband wanted to put up his clothes so I sprayed all these damn hangers because I didn't want his clothes in here without spraying these hangers. I didn't clean this bathroom. All my shit over here. I bring my own towels. I bring my own toilet tissue. Yes the fuck I did. <laughs> And it's all like my beauty products and stuff. But I got like a makeup towel. I got a face towel. Wash my ass towel. Then I got all my makeup in there. 
Then I have the toiletries. I don't want to be sitting on the toilet. So I bought some of these to sit on the toilet just to make sure that it's all nice and sanitized. Yeah, that's about it. So all in all, I mean, coming to the hotel is cool. They even gave us a bottle of wine because it's our anniversary. <laughs> there wasn't a lot of people in the hallway. They don't do housekeeping anymore unless you're here four or more days. They don't have the um, room service anymore. But where we're staying at, there's plenty of places to eat, plenty of places to walk to, which is great. Um, so you might want to think about that when you're coming to the hotels too, to see if they have like the room service and stuff or see how far you're going to have to go and get food. But besides that, it's been kind of quiet and I like that it's quiet, you know, I haven't seen anything, but of course I'm being extra careful with cleaning everything. So you can call me OCD. Yes, bitch. I am OCD and I'm trying to make sure that we are cool and safe. Okay. But besides that, it's been pretty good. Later on, we're gonna get we're gonna get cleaned up, and I think we about to go. I don't know, do something, but I need like another drink, so we about to head out. So here is the bottled wine that they gave us for free. It was very sweet. This is the bag that it came in, and they gave us wine, and they also gave us the little plastic uh, champagne cups as well. I thought that was so sweet. And he had to have this like in the refrigerator or something because look at the glistening water coming off of it. It was super cold. I thought that was super sweet. I was like, yes, anniversary. Look at all that gray in your face. Baby. Yes, that is a picture of my drink for the sweet. Yes, our cute little shirts. What you say? I stole her heart and mine says... Ugh. So I took his last name. Ain't that cute, y'all? <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, Mrs. Allen. Mm. <laughs> we were just having some fun in our cute little shirts. We went out to breakfast. It was so sweet. They put happy anniversary on our receipt. Now we're just out overlooking the top of the hotel, overlooking where Joey's is, where we're going to go and eat later. But this well, is gorgeous up here, y'all. Just looking at this. We're on the Sky Bridge. I'm going to walk you guys across it and let you see what it looks like. It's so beautiful. They were actually cleaning the Sky Bridge. This gentleman that Hello, I walked by. They were actually cleaning the railings and stuff off. So that made me feel good. I was like, okay. At least they're, you know, doing some extra cleaning to kind of help with the COVID cases. Yes. And we had our gloves and all of our stuff, so we was doing it up and being safe. But this is a view from one of the sky bridges, so this goes from the hotel over to Bellevue Square. I don't even have to go outside. No, honey, we can walk over that sky bridge, and it's gorgeous. So right here, we're going to go hang out at Lucky Strike. It is a Microsoft building inside of Bellevue Square. Like I said, this is the bougie area, honey. So watch us play some games. Yes. Lucky Strike is really cool. It's very adult friendly at night and then kid friendly during the day. <laughs> Why are you smacking it like that? No, didn't go in. Woo. And open. All right, come on. Ready? Come on. I kicked his ass in ice hockey. We played like three or four times. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Come on.
this is the waterfall inside of the Hyatt Hotel downstairs in the lobby. Isn't that beautiful and gorgeous? This is outside um, across the street from the hotel. This is in front of Joey's where I love to go eat. This is my favorite place for some wings. Isn't that beautiful? Good down here yesterday. Man, hey. Anniversary. Our shirt. Looking like some burglar. <laughs> we took another snapshot. Here is the wings bomb. I had a cute little wine drink. He had a little beer. Later on, we got out. I had to get cute. Yes. Do you see the shoes, boo boo? Do you see the shoes? <laughs> We was headed out to the suite again, which is inside of the hotel. Yes, love the suite. It's very sexy. And then here we are at Pipe Place Market. This is downtown Seattle, y'all. If you have not been downtown Seattle, Pipe Place Market is one of the attractions to go. It's very, very beautiful if you have not been down to Pipe Place Market. And then we just walked around to some places because I have not been downtown Seattle in a while, only because things have definitely changed up since COVID. But we still got some cute shots and walked around and seen some different things. It was very beautiful. It was nice to get out. Check this out. Oh, is that a ship right there? Yeah. Oh, that show is. Right there. Norwegian. This is pretty. Who's Boom, Boom line. Pretty. Seattle waterfront. Now that looks very pretty. So because I'm bougie and just because it was just wasn't my cup of tea downtown Seattle, we went back to my favorite place. Back to Bellevue. We went to go have lunch at Joey's and this is me just walking around back in the Hyatt in the hallway walking back to the car from eating. Yes, cute, cute, cute. Have my little unit back on. Ew. <laughs> yes, now this time, this day, we was headed to the Tacoma waterfront going to the brand new Point Rustin Silver Cloud. Again, we went and had breakfast. Then we was driving. This is down on the Tacoma waterfront. It's so gorgeous down there, y'all. It's normally a lot, a lot of people in truly packed, but we got some good days down there where there wasn't a lot of people, which for me, I like it, but you know, to each his own. Um, but it was gorgeous. Yeah, that's what it is. It's a, it's a big ass tanker. Yeah, that's pretty. Know the expensive, expensive wish. And he got that right. It's expensive down here. These are all condos. Yeah, you're gonna need a little bit of coin, honey, to afford these. So, this is walking up to the movie theater that's downtown on the waterfront at Point Preston. Gorgeous. We're about to see a movie, y'all. Cute pick. We had this whole theater to ourselves, okay? Recliner seats and all. It was so nice. Now we are walking over to the Silver Cloud Rustin. Is in the same cul-de-sac as the theater. So all you gotta do is wherever you got your car parked, leave it parked and just keep it pushing. This must be the back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's got the little 
Hold a sec. Okay. Yes, that's where we stay. Oh shit. Right here. This is not it's so pretty. Inside of the hotel. It's so gorgeous. Waterfront. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to ride some, rent some of the bikes, and ride some of the bikes around, like those right there. Stop being fucking lazy. Baby. You can. I ain't lazy. You're lazy. Baby, I'm not lazy. We can get one of them bike rentals in. What up, what up, what up, peeps? We just got out of the movie theater. Now we are down here looking at the beautiful water. It is sexy. The mu the movie was cool. It was a uh, yeah, teaches you a lesson. How uh, you can be so damn uppity and be looking down on people, but at the right moment you're gonna need the person that you're looking down on. So I wasn't too cool and too doom enthused about it, but I watched it and it was actually kind of good. So, yeah. What you think, puppy? Yeah, it was a good movie. Damn, you yawning all in the... I know. I know, baby. I know. This, this breeze This right old here. motherfucker better wake this his ass up. so good, man. Yeah, it's I like, had to man. move because, shit, my ass was hot sitting in there. Man, See that? Man, just come over breeze. here and sit this in the so breeze. Beautiful breeze just us i can finally take this hot ass mask off because i am still social distancing god damn it okay <laughs> you know <laughs> we about to go hit some drinks y'all but we still gonna show y'all this water friend come on let's walk put your mask back on oh look at that mountain up there mm -hmm. what's it let's kiss with the mask on you know what? <laughs> I don't want no room. All right, let's figure out where our room is at. It's probably this way. Oh, there's the ice machine. Four, four, seven. It's down. It's this way. Right here. All right. Whoa. I can't hold this door, so you got to get it. guys this is the view from the room looking down at the waterfront how gorgeous is that you can see miles up that is gorgeous can't say nothing bad about that view okay i paid that premium price for that view and that tub this is so pretty like I said, date night, anniversary, birthday. Yes, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I will tell you, if you're coming to the hotel, go ahead and valet park your car and do not park in that parking garage. They are literally assholes, okay? Just giving you a sweet tip, okay? If you're coming to the hotel, go ahead and valet park your car early. If you like tipping your valets, you're gonna need okay, cash. So this is the view from walking in the door. They have a little safe right here. It's got some little drawers right here. 
stuff to where you put your luggage and stuff out of the way. This is sexy. I love the mirror. They have a little wet bar right here. This is like, yes. This is just down there. This is the fridge. Yes, this is the bed. Sexy. This is the TV. There's some drawers down here. Good storage. Nice, comfy, nice, comfy couch. And here is the tub. The reason why I got this room. This is sexy. It's got the step up. <laughs> what? Then it got the little bath amenities. <laughs> This is on point. This is the view from the bathtub. What? This is sexy. Sexy, sexy, sexy. Yes. Real nice. So we are headed out to go to the grand opening of Copper and Salt. That was just me taking a pic as we are standing at the top. Very cute. This is a pic that the lady had took of us. This yes. is everybody looking at us because we are dressed up and they are not. I could have cared less. I still had fun, but this was grand opening day. If you are a foodie, you're going to love their food. I got like two or three drinks. Also got this. It's called a Bellini. I didn't like it. As you can see, I had multiple drinks. My husband had the cod. It was fun. It was beautiful. But I was hungry when I left because I just don't eat the foodie foodie food. Hey, y'all. It's been a beautiful day. I hope y'all enjoyed watching us coming down on the Tacoma waterfront, Point Reston. The hotel is gorgeous, okay? If you want to bring you a date, anniversary night, it is so damn sexy, okay? We're about to get in that Jetta tub. We're about to enjoy the room. We got some food from Ferrelli's. We went to the opening night of Copper and Salt. I had the Lavender 76 drink beautiful it was so damn good okay it was good my husband had the cod and then he also had something called a bellini because i didn't like it so if you are like a foodie or something you're gonna enjoy the food for me i am picky with my food okay so i had to go get me some pizza so forelli's i am eating now that mm, fire grilled pizza the fire grilled pizza is the bomb and I'm about to try to see how these wings taste. Yes. So we'll follow up with you guys too. Oh, Peace out.